Meanwhile, we do have new details on that deadly explosion in Borough Park. News 12 learning there is a chance that one more person was killed by that incident. We turn now to News 12 Brooklyn reporter Andrew Dimbert with the details. Andrew, what have we learned now? Well, Vanessa, sources close to the situation are telling us that officials suspect that a second person is dead from this explosion. They believe the victim to be a female and saying that they found her cell phone inside of the unit that exploded. And then they traced her cell phone and determined that she was making phone calls inside the unit during the time of the explosion. Again, this is yet to be confirmed, but this is what sources close to the situation are telling us here on the ground. But here's what we have been displaced, but they've all been accounted for in terms of finding a place to live, whether it be in hotels, getting support for the Red Cross, or staying with family members. Also, PS-164 is being used as a support site. That site's going to have to be moved because school is back in session tomorrow. I also want to mention that buildings 4206 and 4204 are set to be demolished in a controlled demolition, and council members are setting up a fund to help anyone displaced or affected by this explosion but the message here today has been that gas explosions can be prevented by simply calling 911 if you smell gas we want you to be wrong there are many people who have called 911 and have been wrong and they are heroes when it comes to this situation everyone here is telling you this is one of the best times that you can be wrong if you think you smell gas please call 911 be wrong and be a hero. Again, there is an active search for that missing person, but sources telling News 12 that officials suspect that that person is dead and that she is a female using her cell phone and tracing it to determine that she made phone calls inside the unit during the explosion. That's the very latest. As soon as we have more, we'll get it to you. Vanessa, back to you in the studio. Hoping for the best there. Thank you so much, Andrew.